The royals are known for having extensive personal staff, but Meghan Markle and Prince Harry are defying stereotypes again. The couple has reportedly not yet hired a nanny, chef or team to help with baby Archie Harrison Mountbatten Windsor instead, they're said to be relying on assistance from the Duchess of Sussex's mother, Doria Ragland. Harry, 34, and Meghan, 37, are using a scaled-down staff at their new home of Frogmore Cottage at Windsor Castle, with Los Angeles-based Doria, 62, now staying with the couple. A source told Grazia UK that Doria has been indispensable with helping the new parents, after baby Archie was born last week. They don't yet have a nanny or a team of staff and there's no chef, the source said, according to Grazia. Doria has been helping out, she has been indispensable. Royal rules Meghan is breaking. Prince Harry was back at work within days of Archie's birth, making a trip to The Hague for the launch of the Invitas Games, and another royal engagement planned for Italy next week for the St. Bob Polo Cup. Yoga teacher Doria has been invited into the royal's inner circle, even appearing in official photographs with the Queen when the monarch met Archie. Royal experts have also noted that Doria was mentioned in the palace's announcement about Archie's birth, with this inclusion said to be highly significant, according to the Daily Mail. The Duchess's mother, Doria Raglan, who is overjoyed by the arrival of her first grandchild, is with their royal highnesses at Frogmore Cottage, a statement from the Parlin said. Meghan's mother is said to have a suite inside the couple's lavish home and will be a frequent visitor though she is not expected to abandon her US base. Meantime, Prince William and Kate Middleton have finally met their new nephew Archie Harrison Mountbatten Windsor. The Duke and Duchess of Cambridge reportedly traveled to Frogmore Cottage on Tuesday to meet the baby, a week after Meghan gave birth. The royals are known for rigid protocols, but Meghan Markle and Prince Harry have continuously broken the rules. Even during Meghan's pregnancy, the couple who tied the knot in May last year chose not to reveal her exact due date, rather releasing a public statement when she was in labor. The couple announced the birth of baby Sussex in a joint statement on Instagram, declaring simply it's a boy. Shining the royal tradition of fronting the media within hours of birth, Prince Harry instead appeared solo. I'm very excited to announce that Meghan and myself had a baby boy early this morning, a very healthy boy. Mother and baby are doing incredibly well, Harry said, speaking on the grounds of Windsor Castle.